French Yellow Vest protests in Paris avoid last week's riots. Paris U scattered Yellow Vest protesters clashed with French police firing tear gas Saturday after a peaceful march through Paris, but tougher security measures and protest bans in high risk neighborhoods prevented the kind of rioting that devastated the capital a week ago. A. The four month old movement drew bigger crowds Saturday than in recent weeks even though last weekend's violence dented overall support for the cause. The protesters want thousands of demonstrators marched peacefully through Paris, you their 19th straight weekend of protests, you ending up at the Sacre Coeur Cathedral overlooking the city from the historic Montmartre neighborhood. Protesters sprayed yellow flares and unfurled a neon banner from atop the cathedral's white dome. In a relaxed mood, later, however, tensions erupted as small clusters of masked protesters set garbage cans on fire and threw projectiles as they moved toward Republique Plaza in eastern Paris. Helmeted riot, a police officer on the plaza suffered a heart problem, slumping to the ground before being hospitalized in what Paris police described as a very at least 2,000 people have been injured in protest violence since the Yellow Vest movement began in November, and 11 people have been killed in protest-related road accidents. Elsewhere in France on Saturday, small groups of demonstrators and police clashed in the southern French cities of Nice and Montpellier. Nice was placed on overall though. Saturday's protests were calmer than a week ago, when resurgent violence reminded France's government that they failed to quell yellow vest anger. Luxury shops, this week, Interior Minister Christophe Castaner estimated that 40,500 people took part in protests around France, up from 14,500 a week ago. This week's protests, some 233 people were arrested, including people trying to come to Paris to protest with baseball bats, slingshots, and other potential weapons, Castaner said. French authorities banned protests from the Champs-Élysées Avenue in Paris and the central neighborhoods of several other cities including Bordeaux, Toulouse, Marseille and Nice in the south, and Rouen in western France. The Champs-Élysées was almost empty Saturday except for a huge police presence. Fear of more violence The new Paris police chief, Didier Lalamant, who took charge this week following the destruction wrought by last week's protests, said specific police units were created to react faster to any violence. About 6,000 police officers were deployed in the capital Saturday and two drones helped monitor the demonstrations. French authority, that decision prompted criticism from opposition leaders and some protesters. Since Polls suggest last week's violence dampened public support for the Yellow Vests U, but that a majority of French people still agree with the protesters' anger over France's tax system and Macron's leadership. Saturday's marchers held signs demanding more say for citizens in public policy. We the protests started in November to oppose fuel tax hikes but have expanded into a broader rejection of Macron's economic policies, which protesters say favor businesses and the wealthy over ordinary French workers. Macron countered, the Yellow Vest movement was named after the fluorescent garments that French motorists must carry in their vehicles for emergencies. Milos Krivokopic and Chris Denhond in Paris contributed to this report. Looking up, open the park pot.